Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Signalis. So in the last episode we finally got the administrator's card from Adler's office, used it on the mine shaft, and right now we are at the mining station. We did go much lower in the last episode as well, but then we died when we ran into this Silent Hill-like monstrosity in a very fleshy looking hell. So we have to go back there and this time hope that we can actually defeat that monster. And also before we start, I'm also right now using the uh, Xbox 360 controller. Because I've been playing with the mouse and keyboard for so long that I got used to it and I decided that, you know what, let's try with the controller for now and see how the game feels like to play with an actual controller. So without further ado, let's go. And so far, I literally just now uh, picked, up the, picked up the controller and it feels very smooth. Very smooth and it's easy to figure out that what button does what. And here you take out the gun. I can aim like this. You can see the controls here again if you want if you want to see them. I wonder does the yes we are about we are here now, okay. So let's go back to where we where we where we left off, where we died to be more spe to be to be more specific. Oh, and there's some replica replicas here. Did I explore this entire place in the last episode? I don't think that we went here, did we? Maybe we did come here last time. Um, actually, no, I don't think we... Oh, what the... Why did I walk, walk, walk into that? I thought I stopped. Oh. And there's some more survivors there. And they are not doing so well. Wait. Ah, okay, so... She keeps walking. Because I, I'm not I'm not pressing any buttons right now and she's walking. So that's what happened earlier there. Have to keep that in mind. That that's a thing. Not sure if I like that to be honest. I wonder if, if, if there's a way to change that. Stop moving. Okay. And we have read this already, haven't we? Yes. That seems like a health item. Oh, and I think that... Oh. How do I get to my... Uh, there. Yes, we still have this. That's a health item. Uh, how, uh, how much space do I do I have here again? None. Hmm. I don't even have I don't even have any health items with me. I guess the idea. I guess I was thinking last time that well, I don't need any need any health items if I don't get hit. That was I, that was probably the idea. Also, what ammo am I carrying? Handgun ammo and uh, shotgun ammo. Okay. And let's let's carry the shotgun. I just need to shoot two more times so I can reload uh, these into it, and then I have at least one more slot free. So, how you doing? I stop moving. Star. Hey, don't cry. It'll be over soon. Hey, Yuli. Stop. Stop moving. Remem remember that time we went to the surface? The stars were so beautiful. I wish we could go there again. Well the well well the coast is clear. I have killed quite a few of those things, so you can go and try. Hey listen. I'll let you in on a secret. I can remember my name. From my old life. Old life? Aren't you just a an android essentially? Or cyborg? Wh whichever term is the right one here. Isn't that funny? Maybe they did we used to be humans, but then we, then, but then we were, then we we were repurposed as robots, so we are essentially cyborgs. 
Don't you want to know it? Here, I'll tell you. It'll be our secret together. So you can stop crying, okay? It'll be okay. Wherever it is, I'm going. I'll wait for you there. Ah, oh, that's so sweet and sad at the same time. Okay, no more comments. They, they, they don't even acknowledge that I'm here. Okay. So let's keep in mind that we have that health item here. Jesus, that door <laughs> goes up and down fast. Closes and opens fast, even. Okay, is there anything else that... Oh, they didn't notice you there. Shit. Oh, God. I don't think that it's... I don't think that it's worth to fight all fight all of you. Yeah, I'm go going here. Bye bye. I don't see much of a point to waste my ammo ammo on you guys. Oh, I didn't notice you either. Jesus. I don't have the pistol. That oh shit. Jesus, that. That one ha actually has a pretty good aim. Not as sloppy as the first. What was that? What was that uh, model called again? Something that started with N. Those are. Okay. Oh. Ouch, shit. Ouch. Ouch. Fuck. Shit. Ouch. I'm still struggling with the controls. Shit, Jesus. I didn't want to shoot again. Oh. That was terrible. No space. Ah, oh, yes. Uh, what's reload? Uh, son of a bitch, don't... Shit. Oh, that's reload. I should have checked. I should have... I uh, should have checked it. Okay, well, this went so... This went so terribly that, you know what? I'm gonna reload. Alright, let's try this again and not fuck it up this time. Okay, what was that? Okay, that was the aim button, okay. Don't spin around too much. Yeah, I'm starting to think that it was easier to aim and shoot with the mou <laughs> mouse. Oh shit, son of a... And also I'm having... And also I'm using the wrong gun here. Okay, step on you. Oh, son of a... Stop shooting and run. That didn't even hit. Well, fuck. At least that one is down for now. Uh, Oh, that's opening. Ouch. What? She's still not down? Oh, that's bullshit. Okay, well, let's use the handgun here. That yeah, feels quite awkward to try and aim. Don't walk there. Okay. That one is down. I could drop down, but I want to take care of this one. You never know if we come back. And I don't want any nasty surprises. Let's just wait till she goes down again. Did 
Did I reload? I think I did. Only got one hit there. But yeah, uh, so far it feels like it's much easier to aim and shoot with the uh, mouse. Mouse and keyboard. But it also could be because I, I'm not used to this con uh, controller's controls yet. I wonder if this game was made uh, mainly with the mouse and keyboard or the controller in mind. Or both equally. At least I can pick up this. Our health situation is not that great, so let's use this or... Oh wait, restores a large amount of health over time, and let's not... Let's not use it then, not yet. Alright, she's, she's coming over there. I have to wait till she collapses. Like that. Don't spin around so much. She's still not down. What's my ammo situation with this? Only 5 shots left. We used 15 shots or more than 15 shots on that on that freaking thing. See, this is why and this is why I try I try not to uh, kill and waste all of my ammo on every every uh, enemy that we come across. Should I go back and get the pistol? Or the magnum, whatever it was called? And she's finally down. Okay, well... Alright, so let's go back to that one room and get the... The lock is defective, so the door cannot be opened. Well, fuck. I guess we are stuck here then. Okay, is there anything anything else here? There must be, I mean, some. there must be some ammo or something lying around here, right? Guess not. Alright. Let's lie down. Alright, I think at last time we went here. Oh, there's some ammo here. Perfect. Hmm, cannot be opened. And oh, there's a hole here. Okay. We went down there last time. So, what was over here? Ah, just a... Uh, repair spray. Okay, I got two health items now. That's good. I got a disposable prod as well. I wonder, do I need the light here anymore? Not really, no. So this is where Adler was pushed down by our uh, friend, Iso or whatever whatever her name was. Okay. Yeah, let's jump down. There's no other, no other way.
Do we now go to the first person perspective? Mm, yes, we do. Shame that we can't sprint or run because we're otherwise quite uh, quite slow. So I was wondering that if there's something over here. Let's check this aside. Okay, there is some notes down here. Um, in one kind of death, the spirit also dies. While yet the body was in vigor for many years, sometimes it died with the body, but raised up again where the body did decay. Okay, looks like normal stones. And a star fell uh, from the sky, I guess. Uh, and a mount mountain fall fell into the sea and turned to blood. M moon turned dark. It calls me in a sea of flesh. We will become one, but I can never go back to being me. And what are these? Looks like just stones. White stones. Oh, that looks... Oh, these are skulls. Okay, they're just skulls. Skulls buried into the sand. Is that anything? Uh, no, I don't think so. Spooky. Oh, we can't go further there than this. There's an invisible wall. You, you, love, you love it when you run into invisible walls in video games, don't you? Unless we can go around. Oh, can we go there? No, I thought I thought there was going to be a narrow pathway here or something, but no. Hmm. Okay. And now we are... I don't actually know where we are. Well, we are still in the mines, I guess, but... Another sp spray gun? Or re repair spray? Lifeless replica mob bodies are lying on, on the slabs. Rusted surgical tools. They are not much use to me. What was this note again? Offerings. And in the darkness the dead shall be offered. A light and holy sp uh, spices so that they may find a way out of this cursed place. Auto injector, okay. I have multiple of them, do I? Oh no, I have, uh, I have only one. Hmm, okay. And how do you use items here exactly? Use tool... Uh, okay, LB, it's that one. Let's see if I remember that. Was there another door that I missed? Ah, uh, yes, there is. Okay, repair patch. But I can't pick it up because I'm carrying too much shit. Um... Neither handgun ammo. That's just great. I guess I have to equip this and use it. But then again, it would require that I die. Or, 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 that, or, that I'm, or that I'm about to die. Oh, I didn't notice this last time. Oh, hey, that's the same symbol that, that you see in the Beautiful Desolation. I can... 
I was about to say that I can barely see the symbols on this button, but buttons, but I don't. But now I, I, I'm not seeing them clearly enough. Well, oh, okay, it's one of these. One of the very first puzzles that we that we did in the first episode of this playthrough was was this kind of puzzle as well. We have to press the uh, we we have to press the right buttons. We have to light the light right buttons to open it. It unlocks from the other side. Okay. Oh wait, wait, wait. I oh, never mind. We didn't come from here. Another prod over there. That's for the. That ammo is for the uh, armor piercing pistol. Now I kind of I really wish that I would have uh, picked that one up instead of the handgun that we have now. Yeah, I don't want to drop down there. Warnings. This place, nothing value is here. What is, was dangerous and repulsive. Message is a warning about the danger is still present. Time as it was is to the bloody end. Form of the danger is, the danger is. Dis uh, disturbed this place, shunned and left uninhabited. Yeah, okay. Should I fight these guys? Ouch, why did I run, run, run right into them? Well, I'm still cautious, so it's not that bad, but let's use one of these. What is this? Large wooden doll. There's no other doors here leading out. So if we want to go back, we have to go through this. Unlocks from the other side. If only there was another safe room or item box at the very least somewhere. And we don't have a... How do I get the map? Hmm, okay. And there's no map data. So I can't even see if I have missed any doors. There's no doors here, not that I can see. Hmm. This one opens from the other side, so we can only go here. Okay, so... I guess I would want that prod from over there. Which item I was wearing right now? The injector, okay. We are still at caution. That doll is important, obviously. But uh, I'm full on I'm full on items. I got only ten uh, handgun ammo on this and three shotgun shells. That's not going to be enough to defeat that one whatever monstrosity we died to last time. That's not gonna be enough. So I'm, I'm a little, I'm a bit screwed here, to be honest with you. Well, ah, okay, we didn't, we we don't face the monster just yet. Let's see if there's a. There's a door here, I think, and it requires a key apparently. Ah, here was it. Here's the safe room. Thank God. Thank God. Uh huh. Leave. Uh, leave. Leave this place. Can we? Can we pick it up or? Guess not. And this. Hmm. Okay. Another one of these locks. All right, so let's see. What do we want to get rid of for now? Well, I kind of want to get rid of this because it just 
takes inventory space, and I don't, I don't think that we are, I don't think that we are gonna need it that desperately. I got two of these, seven of these. Holy shit! Quite a few injectors, five. I don't want to waste these. Uh, how about the flare gun? A single shot gun for firing 26 and half millimeter emergency signal flare cartridges uh, that incinerate targets. Could this work? I mean, if, if this gun can basically one shot kill that monster, then sure, I, I'll use this. I might as well put the shotgun away. There's only three shots left in it. Take the revolver. Take the handgun ammo. And, uh... Nope. Uh, didn't want to do that. Why aren't you reloading? Oh, are you carrying the wrong gun? Oh, it is fully reloaded, okay. Okay, so we got 30 shots with the handgun now. Six in the revolver. There's some more ammo left for the handgun here. Is that 18? It's kind of hard to tell what which number is it sometimes. 18, yeah. 18 and we left some behind in these rooms as well. Okay, let's get rid of the auto injector. Just don't get hit, lol. It should be fine. And besides, we got two of these, but it restores health over time. So it's not instant. Let's keep that in mind. Is 12 the max? Yes, we can only carry 12 revol revolver bullets, apparently. Okay, well, let's save here before something terrible happens. Uh, let's save here. Okay, I've been playing for quite a while now, and I normally would end the episode here, but we haven't really done any actual progress in this episode. I've been struggling with these controls all this time. Let's, at the very least, defeat that monster, if we can. Oh, shit, of course I can hit. And there's the fleshy, fleshly anus. Uh, what's this? Unlocks from the other side, okay. Another repair patch, but we are full on everything, right? Yeah. I wonder if we can use these. On the monster thingy when it's down. Well, only one way to find out. So, shit. <laughs> it looks like I'm doing terrible job, but I'm 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 have to take the gun out and aim it at the same time while that thing is come is rushing at me, and I prefer not to get hit because getting hit is bad. In case you didn't know, okay. You know, it would be helpful if you actually... Son of a... Shit, ouch. These controls are not helping. Uh, use that. Ouch, son of a... It would be helpful if you actually, well, you know, help me. Ouch, ouch, ouch. I'm dead. <laughs> I got stuck there. Okay, let's run all the way here. Why are you so damn fast? Ow, son of a... Why are you so goddamn fast?
I can't get a good shot. Ouch. Run, 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 run. Okay. <laughs> Even my controls are vibrating now. Okay, uh... Can I use that? Yes, I can use that. Shit. Oh, ouch. Why does he have to spin so much when... When I wanna aim? Take that. I got one more of those that things left. Oh, don't don't run into it. And I got one more. I can you please die? Ouch. Uh, use that, sure. Let's take the out. Oh, let's let's take the revolver. Maybe I should have used the revolver since the beginning. I really hate how she spins around like 180 degrees when I try to aim. Son of a just. Maybe there's. Maybe I need to change some settings or something. Reload quickly and uh, use this. Oh, you're finally done. Shoot it. Nice. Thanks. Good job. Took you long enough to load your gun. Yeah, she should be fine. Oh, we are in a different safe room now. Can I take your gun? The rifle Isa was carrying. Isa, not Iso. Close enough. It's chambered in some sort of ridiculous anti-armor cartridge. No wonder the recoil knocked her out. Now what do we have here? Thermite flares. Oh fuck yes, these are useful. Pick up that as well. Ammo situation is... Uh, it's decent. It's decent, and what about... She won't wake up. Unconscious, huh? And I... So I got two of these things left. We used all the prods, but hey. Those prods went to very good use there, so I'm not complaining. Let's put these away. Okay, let's... uh. Reload our guns. Five handgun ammo and six of these. Might as well take all of these from here. I wonder if the flare gun would have would have one shot killed that thing. Okay, uh, let's save it. Uh, now let's save it here. Okay, well, I think I should end this episode here. I mean, even though we didn't do that much progress in this episode, admittedly, we just killed that monster, but hey, that, that's enough for me. I've been mostly struggling in, in struggling with these new controls of this uh, of this controller. But I've been playing for, for, so, for so long that I, that I might as well end this episode here and see where we can go from here. Let's see, uh, can we... Okay, this uh, this also got one of those special uh, locks. Okay. Oh, leave. So the only way is... Well, there's another door here. So we can go here. Does this open? Oh, it, it's this room, okay. So the only way to go is here. Well, let's see where this leads. What the hell is that thing over there?
What the heck, hell kind of replica design is that? Okay, well... Ah, fuck it, let's play at, at, at least a little, little, little bit more. Pick up the repair patch. That thing is annoyingly guarding that pathway. Oh, they either, either didn't notice me or, they, or it doesn't care. How much space do I have? Uh, none. No space. Ah, because I picked this one up. Let's not pick up that broad. Not yet. What's this? Regent's ring. Let's not pick it up yet. Is that a shotgun ammo? Yes, pick, pick that one up. We can just go and uh, place it inside the uh, item, item box and come back here for the ring. Where else can we go? Oh great, barbed wire. That I can barely see sometimes. Ouch, what the... Yeah, pick it up, sure. What the... What's hurting me? Is it the barbed wire? A blade of flesh, another one of these. Um, hmm. Maybe I shouldn't, I shouldn't have pick, picked up these shotgun shells. I knew I shouldn't have. But I did it anyway, because it's shotgun shells. You always want to pick up the shotgun shells. Son of a... I'm not gonna... Oh, I'm not gonna die because of this, am I? Well, apparently, yes, I am. Okay, now I kind of wish that I had the flashlight so I could see if I could go... If there's a door over there. Ouch. Well, this is an annoying room. Because I can barely see some of the... Uh... I can just barely see some of the barbed wires. That's so annoying. Alright, well, let's keep going. Let's keep going a little more. Well, let's just run past these fools. Ah, <laughs> they don't even notice me. Okay. That's fine by me. Okay, so, uh... Okay, so I have only one item slot here. So let's not pick up the shotgun shells just yet. And that and this leads us to the <coughs> barbed trap room. Yeah. That is important thing, no no doubt. Actually, can I change my settings somewhat? Let's see. Uh, gameplay. Tech speed. Com combat accessibility. Normal. Survival. For experienced survival horror fans, enemies deal more damage. Uh, yeah, let's not deal with this. Uh, quick EIG. Automatically equips available stun broads when appropriate. Uh, let's not do that either. Control style, standard. Mm. Tank controls, no thank you. Uh, let's just go with the standard then. Directional controls are relative to the character. E.g. up moves forward. Uh, let's, not, let's not mess around with those. I'm having hard time with these new Controller controls already as it is. Let's see. Uh, oh, this is how I, how I change this. Okay. Graphics. Audio. Controls. Okay. Sprint style hold. Aim style hold. Toggle. That might, that might actually... Oh, quick. What does, what does quick mean? Toggle. This might... Make things. Uh, this might make things a bit easier for me, but what I what I really want to change is the way that how how my character keeps walking even after I uh, press nothing. Swap aim controls uh, off. Swaps the left and right stick while aiming. Not compatible with tank style or quick aim. I can't apparently adjust the movement controls. Okay, well, 
Let's go with this. Let's go with this. I just have to get used to this, that's all. Okay, I can see those. Is there... No, there's no pop wire there. Yeah, I think I need the bloody flashlight here. Should have taken should have taken that with me. All right, well, could we go here? No. Okay. Let's get the flashlight and actually wh while I'm here, reach and ring. Okay, so a ring cut from black marble. The phrase "This too shall pass" is in is inscribed on the inside of the ring. Okay. Nothing else interesting, I don't think. Okay, well let's let's bring this to the item box and then let's take the the uh, <coughs> excuse me the flashlight here. Yeah. All right, let's use this. Now I can see them better. Okay, this is a bigger maze. Hmm, is there anything here? Rusted key. Okay, sure. And there is that. Now oh, there's two <coughs> repair sprays here. Hope I'm gonna take this. Blade of flesh with a circle shaped, well, flesh in there. Okay, but now I'm full on, uh, full, yes. Can't pick up anything else for now. But let's see, is there anything else? Hmm, can't go further to the north, I see. Yeah, no, there's nothing else there. Okay, so there's only two health health or repair sprays left here, so let's keep that in mind, because they might become handy when I run out of health items and stuff. But now, let's... Yeah, let's just go back and bring these items to the my item box for now. Or, oh, okay, they did notice me eventually. Well, since we got the chance now, can I... Yes, we can go in here. And what do we have here? Signal flare shells. Oh, this must this must go to the flare gun. Okay. Okay, and we got another repair spray plus here. Unlock the door. Okay, so we are back here now. Okay, nice. Very nice. Let's, uh... Now, where was the safe room? Oh yeah, there's a doll there as well. Have to pick that one up. But now, uh... <coughs> where was the... Wasn't there a safe room here? Wasn't there a safe room up here? Mm, where were we in this room before? Um, we still have the key, so, so we didn't use that. What's this? Small bottle. And a diary. The Dreamer. Are they talking about Cthulhu? The Dreamer. A prison from which the only escape is death. Deep below, the dreamer floats in the sea of flesh. The red eye birthed in a new world from their dream for eternity, and each time the dreamer turns over in their sleep. Or maybe they are referring to Asatoth. The world turns over too until only flesh remains. Interesting. So that bottle is going to be important, obviously. But I can't really dump anything away. I can use one of these, at least. 
I can't reload my gun anymore. Any, any more any more than it's because it's all already fully loaded. I could I can't even throw them away. Apparently. Okay, well let's find a damn safe room. Ah, oh, it's it was over here, right? Yes, over here. Okay, nice. So let's place these into the box, and then we need to go and get the doll and then the small bottle. Okay, here's the small bottle. So, a small bottle bottle filled with a clear liquid. The contents smell sh sharply of ammonia. Ammonia, huh? Okay, it kind of looks like an ink bottle to me. And there was nothing else here, right? I don't think so. And then we pick up this. Yes, pick it up quickly. Ouch! Son of a. Took some took some uh, unne unnecessary damage there, but. Uh, ouch! Son of a. Fuck. Might as well go to the safe room down here, I guess. We're at caution. That's not ideal. But I got so many of these. Uh, in the. Oh, let's 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 take a close look at this by the way a large hollow wooden doll that can be opened it has a hexagonal hexagonal base it's empty inside empty inside you say you said it can be opened hmm okay well let's go yeah let's go down okay so we got quite a few new items in this game uh, in this episode so what do we put away? Smell sharply of ammonia. Well, let's put that away as well. We got quite a bit of space here right now. And now we only carry the flashlight, the handgun and some ammo. Let's take the rest of the... Actually, there is no more handgun ammo. Okay, well... Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. So, let's save here. And it was here. And in the next episode, well, let's explore some more and see where else we can go. Because I don't think that we have entered all the rooms where we, where we can uh, at this point. And then we have to figure out that what the hell are we gonna do with those uh, items that we just picked up. So, until next time. Thank you for watching once again, and see you next time for more Signalis.